What's up, guys? Uh, it's Monday, March 27th at 8.48 a.m. Uh, I didn't do a video watch. This is actually the second video watch that I'm doing for the day. The first one I posted had all my Ibiza music on it. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I posted and I didn't even fucking realize I was on FaceTime with Tosh. And then I see all this rave shit, rave, this, that. And I'm like, what the hell? So I was playing some Fisher and playing some Swedish House Mafia. And I guess I'm, I don't know what the hell happened. I just didn't even fucking realize. Uh, so let me kind of get into the watch list now. I guess everyone just woke up in the morning, which is hilarious. But all right, let's get to this. Where is the watch list? Okay. So let's start from the beginning again. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. <laughs> all right. Um, all right, I am out. So this is a stock that a lot of shorts are bet on. If you look at it, it had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight almost red days in a row. This day it went red and rebounded, so it doesn't really count. Um, today they have a PR with Bill Gates' name in it, so that's uh, a big kind of red flag on the short side. For me personally, what I'm doing is I'm waiting for the first red day setup. Uh, if I attack any pops, I'm going to be using 30% size. Even if it's under view app, I'm going to be using 30% size. I will not size up on INO unless it is the first red day. That's it. Next, MBOT. Um, this is kind of a runner on Friday. This stock likes to have a bunch of offerings intraday. So what I'm looking for in the mornings, there's a 920 pre-market close, which is kind of like the inner line. But kind of watching this 950 level, watching this um, and this 10 level here. Hopefully we get a tank towards you know 870 and then a bounce towards green to short that bounce. MDGS, uh, this is a low hanging fruit. Uh, it tanked on Friday and they had a PR today. If you draw your lines, you can see exactly where it rejected, right? So in the morning, what I am looking for is I am looking for a morning pop towards kind of 260, 270 level, right? 260, 270 level in the morning, hopefully. Um, AYTU was a death line setup. Um, it broke the death line and never really came back. So kind of looking for a pop towards 190 or two in the morning. NAKD, this is a nano float, less than 1 million share float on the stock. Uh, so I'm not interested in shorting this. This is gonna probably be a chat room pump target. So gonna kind of keep it on side radar. Um, and I think that's it. So again, sorry for playing all those Ibiza songs in the morning. Um, um, it's Monday, you, got, you guys just gotta let me do my thing on Monday. Uh, I guess what we'll do is the secret word or a secret phrase, maybe put like a YouTube link to your favorite song or a song that you listen to in the morning. Uh, <laughs> I'm still fucking laughing. So anyway guys, let's, let's mark it all open up soon. So we'll, we'll talk later. Uh, I'm gonna do a YouTube recap at 11 o'clock today.